Okay, the last thing we haven't mentioned, that damage to the thalamus can also result in emotional problems sometimes. And that's because the thalamus has, you know, interactions with what's known as the limbic system or the limbic area, pretty much the limbic system. And that system is associated with emotional responses. I mean, all our perceptions are associated with emotions. Okay, I mean, that's just part of the beauty of being a human being. So when you look at blue or you look at a certain color or any perception we have, sensory event is in a sense clouded or colored by, if you will, you know, with, with emotional content. It's not just that's a table. I mean, a lot of things are in a sense neutral. I, I, you know, I could care less it's a table. But if that thing was orange, maybe I'd feel better about it. Or if a mark of this table was nice red, then he'd you know, have a good warm feeling about it, possibly. So the point, and that again starts at this real primitive level where the thalamus has interactions with the limbic system. Okay? So does that make sense? I mean, everyone should realize that even on different days, if you see the same stimulus, you will have a different perception of it. 